Hello, it's James. Uh, I'm just checking in uh, about a week after my last video, like I said I would. I, uh, basically did everything I said I would do for the most part. I did skip a couple days because of severe leg soreness, um, but there was also a lot of, uh, what should I say... A lot of personal issues I was dealing with for that day or those two days. So it's probably a good thing that I was skipping them for the soreness anyway. But, you know, I'm going to own up to it and say that I did skip a couple days. Um, I've had some really good workouts, though. And each workout that I do, I've increased the amount of weight that I'm lifting for the weight for the lifts that I'm doing as well as the amount of repetitions. So I'm pretty psyched about that. Um, I know especially for my leg day that caused the soreness to begin with, that was a really strong workout for me. And uh, I know that I did my maximum squats so far yet that uh, I've ever done. And it's it's a really good feeling having those gains of uh, increase in weight for each lift because it's just like I don't know it's like before I I was just doing 12 of everything and I never really pushed myself to up the weight and now it's like every time I'm like I'm gonna try some more weight than last time you know and it's so far not like killing me it's dropping my reps sometimes but I mean if I can do at least five to seven I'm in a good good spot you know if i'm trying to up the weight anyway five to seven is what i should be shooting for i think um anyway as far as my intake goes i've done extremely well with my intake i'm super happy with my intake because i pretty much drank nothing but water i had a little bit of soda the last night when we went out to mongolian grill but other than that i mean just water pretty much a coffee here and there to keep me awake at work and some chicken broth um the chicken broth isn't very good though because of the high sodium in it so i probably should cut back on that um other than that i have been taking a protein shake and a greek yogurt to work with me each day instead of doing the um meal before work that I usually was doing so instead I'm basically going starting my shift and protein shake Greek yogurt tides me over till 11 I don't even feel hungry half the time and if I do uh, that's why I've been nibbling on chicken broth or crackers or something to tide me over till but I mean I can feel that there's less calories in me because I am a little bit hungrier in between eating but I'm definitely not um upset with it like I wasn't starving it was like just enough to get me to the next meal kind of thing um and speaking of the meal at 11 that I usually take my break on I have been eating pretty healthy actually I essentially I've been eating like chicken like kind of like a chicken salad it's like a chicken wrap but in salad form um and I've been eating, like, maybe a soup if it's, like, a soup that I enjoy. But I haven't been picking out. I haven't had extra sandwiches or anything. I did one day, but, I mean, you're allowed to have, like, a piggy day every now and then. And I think that's my goal for the coming week as far as intake goes, is I'm going to start trying to have, like, two days of work days where I, I eat, um... Uh, where I eat light, I guess, for my meals. And then I'll have, like, one day where I just go nuts and eat whatever I want. And I think that that's a good alternative to just trying to cut it off completely. Because if I cut it off completely and then I fail, then I'll be like, well, fuck it, I already failed. S excuse my French. Uh, I'll be like, screw it, I already failed. And then I'll just continue to eat badly. Because, you know, if you already failed, then you might as well while you're failing, uh, continue to fail because it tastes better, you know, or something like that. But, um, 
I don't know. I'm definitely pretty psyched because I, I weighed myself for the last three days straight and I'm hovering around 202.4 for the last three days um, after my sleep. So that means compared to the last one, the last weigh-in, which I, last week was like 207, uh, I've c dropped a consistent five pounds since then. Um, on top of that, I think I'm thinning up a little bit, but I really don't know. Uh, I take that with a grain of salt. Um, I have to say though, I'm pretty, I feel pretty energetic. Um, my personal issues that I've been going through this week have kind of drained some energy out of me and definitely I'm not quite as happy, but, uh, I'm getting through it, and I just kind of had like a, not a remake myself day, but like a revitalize myself day, basically, and I've cleaned the house pretty well, I'm still working on it, um, I need to do a little bit of laundry, but I got all the clothes that were on the floor and stuff up off the floor, I made my bed, as you can see behind me, I have like the sheets on the bed, and the pillows piled up nice and neat, and that little bear right up. Right there, that is Twinkle. That's my bear that my grandma gave me, and uh, it sleeps on my bed with me. I'll admit it. Anyway, um, yeah, my house is getting pretty clean. I'm happy about that. Did some dishes, got some trash ready to take out. Uh, I finally went through that p massive pile of stuff on the floor in the living room, and it's basically packed up and ready to go to Goodwill. Um, I'm getting the nerve to, uh, go take out that Christmas tree, but I think I'm going to do it at night because the landlord's kind of weird and I feel like she might, like, tell me I can't put it on the curb or something stupid. I don't even know, but I'm just going to do it tonight, um, after the D&D &D game or something when it's dark and the manager is all hushed up in her house. Um... Yeah, I mean, I've been going to work. I had Danny's game yesterday, which I posted videos of. You can check that out in my YouTube channel. Um, make sure you like and subscribe, guys, because it... I don't know, that's what everyone asks, so I figured I'd ask, so do it. Um, feel free to comment on the video, especially, because I, I really do like the feedback, just knowing that uh, you are listening to what I'm saying and have something to say or, you know, you're kind of involved in my growth with me kind of thing. I don't know. It, it's just it, it feels more like a community when people comment. So I really enjoy that. Um, I only got a few comments from the last one. But, you know, it's me talking about myself. So I really have not very high expectations anyway. But I'm hoping that this kicks off or at least, like, helps me to improve myself, which is the goal. I don't think I have too many other things to say about that. Uh, my goal for the next week is to continue drinking massive amounts of water, doing the protein shake thing. I mean, the whole intake thing, I think I got on lock. The only thing I think uh, I didn't mention is I have no longer bought any sweet teas for the last week while I was at work and that's an improvement because that was a lot of extra calories I was drinking while I was at work and now I'm just drinking water which is zero calories so it's like it's cutting at least what three to six hundred calories out of my day just not drinking sweet tea because uh, I was drinking like three a shift at least and that's like 150 per so uh, it's a significant calorie decrease because of that. Um, yeah, I don't really know. Uh, I mean, that's pretty much it. I, my goals other than that is just continue hitting the gym. I have decided not to worry about a full two-hour gym session. Um, I've actually been hitting about the 115 to 130 mark as far as uh that goes i've also decided to take ryan's advice finally um and i cut out 
the hour of cardio, and I've actually just been working primarily on weightlifting uh, with a little bit of cardio at the end and uh, like a five-minute cardio at the beginning to get the heart rate up. Um, we'll see if that changes how I feel or like how my body uh, feels. I know that it's a lot more intense on my muscles, but I'm, I'm feeling the soreness a lot more, but it's also like, I don't know, I feel more energetic as well. I just got this new pre-workout called, uh, God, what was it? It wasn't Taze. Taze is what Ryan got. I think it's called Blitz. We got the lime-flavored Blitz. Um, my little brother used it last night for his basketball game, and he said it, it helped, and it tasted really good, so... Um, we're going to see how that goes. Hopefully it's better than the other stuff. I was using prime drive as a pre-workout before, but, uh, prime drive is more of like a passive fat burner, uh, slash make you less hungry thing. So, uh, I guess appetite control would be the way to say that. Uh, anyways, it hasn't really been too much of a deal, so. And I mean, you don't have to pre-workout anyway, but it's something I've been doing. Um, other than that, I don't really have much to say, so I'm gonna go ahead and cut it off there. Like I said, please like and subscribe to my video and my blog, and go ahead and feel free to check out my channel, because I found some really cool stuff, like old videos of me killing shit on world of warcraft i mean come on that's awesome uh and it has some good music tied to those videos too in my opinion anyway um i'm gonna stop trying to sell the channel and i'm just gonna let you guys like you know go do whatever you're gonna do today have a great day and uh thank you very much oh one last thing i decided i'm gonna do this really cool idea um that I came up with when I commented on someone's thing on Facebook. So basically, on the way out the door in the morning, there's always like a sunrise, and it's usually pretty, but uh, sometimes it's like, eh, it's kind of cloudy today, no sunrise, whatever. But I have been taking pictures every day I leave work, and I plan on doing like a time lapse of all of those photos um, over the course of a year of work days so hopefully that turns out really cool because i can like picture it in my head coming out really awesome just a bunch of sunrises for an entire year it's obviously going to take a while to get to the year mark but once i get to that point i'm going to have a ton of sunrise pictures and hopefully if i tie them all together in a mini video it'll look pretty sweet so um yeah Stick around for that. It's only a year away, guys. Yeah. Okay. I'll talk to you later. Thanks for listening. Bye.